Beaverhood, and welcome back to ARMS, and today we are continuing to check out more characters. Last episode, we checked out Lollipop on level two difficulty. It wasn't too impressive, but we did get to the end, and now we're moving on to Misango. I think that's how you pronounce it. It sort of sounds like Missing No from Pokemon, but Misango, he has a little buddy, and I don't know what the little buddy is, so I'm super curious about this. He looks like a lot of fun. He was added, like I think, like a month or two ago. We'll do level three difficulty this time. Oh, but should I do level four next time? Level four next time for sure. Okay, I'm excited for this. Oh, oh wow, I love his area. I just totally runs like Crash Bandicoot. Oh, that's exciting. He's a really cool character so far. Ah, just smell that fresh forest air. Sniffing along with you is your favorite arms commentator, Biff. Today's Grand Prix starts on these uh, on these old temple grounds. Is it me or do those rocks look familiar? Masango. From the remote region of Masanga, named for its eponious deity, it's Masango. His fighting style, enhanced by the spiritual woven entity at his side, has been passed down from generation to generation. According to the vague prophecy, Masango must enter the Grand Prix to prove that Masango fighting style is the greatest in the world. Can his mystical moves translate to a wider audience? Look out, folks, an arms Grand Prix is about to start. He's 33. Like, he doesn't look 33, you know? I mean, I guess 33 really ain't that old. Next thing I know, I'll be 33 and I'll be like, well, well, geez, me? <laughs> Past Zebra, match one on your feet. It's Misango versus the Bouncer Springman. He's a reliable fighter who likes to keep it simple in the ring. Will that be enough against Misango who's fighting in multiple realm, multiple realms? Wait, okay, hold on, there's a little bit more lore I need to get to here. Okay, wow, I like these. We got the Scorpio, the Glusher, and the Scully. These are cool looking arms. Awesome, awesome stuff. Let's try this. Okay, so I don't know what his little buddy does, but I'm gonna guess that's his special ability. It's constantly changing colors, so I'm gonna imagine that is something. Ooh, wow, he moves. I love how his hair bounces as well. Like his hair looks like cool little up arms as well. This is so crazy. <laughs> I love it. Whoop, oh, up. Oh. Got it, got it! So he does 160 damage, which is slightly more. So if anybody, whoa, his arm is weird. If anybody knows how his special ability works, let me know. I might have to actually look it up between rounds or something, because I should have checked before we got into it. Wow, the music here is fantastic as well. I'm really liking this character already. All right, move it, move it. Where are you? Grab you. Oh man, this is already a lot more difficult. Like, I hope that we can actually get to the end. Oh geez, I definitely need to get him out of there. Hold on, hold on. Oh, he has a super. Oh geez, this is looking bad. Oh, oh, nope, why'd I jump? That was literally the opposite of what I was supposed to do. Oh, I'm getting my butt kicked. All right, well, it's a new character. Gotta try him out a little bit. Oh yeah. Okay, so let me also try the Scully. The Scorpio is interesting. What does the Scully do? Let's punch. Whoa, that is quick. Oh, that is real quick, but it's very, very thin. I'm interested to try a double Scully. All right, well, I had a good start last time. This thing has sort of devolved a little bit awfully. Whoa. Good, good, good. You ready for this, sir? Go for him, go for him. Oh, that's a better start than last time, that's for sure. So far, we're perfecting him. Oh, he's all goopy. You're a goopy dude right now. Oh, oh, you're gonna get caught? No, I'm gonna get caught with you. I did that last episode, too. What is wrong with me? <laughs> okay, got him, got him. Well, this is fantastic right now. We're gonna even this up. Nice. I really like his grab, especially with a faster arm like the Skelly. Like, if I'm gonna, you know, be a guy who just grabs all the time, I might as well try for the uh, for the double Skelly. That might be fun. That might be a bit different. Okay, let's try it. <laughs> what do I have to lose on the first round? Got it. So far, I'm still not, oh, oh, hey, what was that? Oh, it acts like as a pillar, similar to the pillars around us. So if I hold this out for long enough, it just sort of gives me something to work around. And since we're a very quick character, now I know what his special ability is. That's very interesting. I mean, I definitely should check that stuff before. Whoa, what is going on? Holy cow. Oh, maybe this is what we're talking about with the extra realm stuff going on. This is so cool. Whoa, I don't know what's happening right now, but it's awesome. This is a lot more in depth than I was thinking. I thought it was gonna end at the, the thing. All right, get you. Oh no, oh no. Well, he might turn it around here. I gotta be ready, gotta be ready. I mean, I still have more than half health and I could just land one punch on him or I could be the worst player 
ever. Yeah, okay, we got it. Yeah, I didn't really know about his mask abilities too much. But okay, now I sort of get it a little bit more. So I'm guessing that depending on the color is gonna determine what we get there. All right, we won a badge, cool. But do excuse me, I'm not very good at arms. I just sort of hop in and we, uh, I, I try what I can. Okay, Master Mummy will be good to practice against, I think, because usually he's just good to maneuver around. All right, keep it friendly. It's Misango versus the Grim Creeper Master Mummy. If your eyes are closed, folks, I get it. Those strange eyeballs looking lights terrify me too. I bet Misango's experience with otherworldly phenomena will come in handy today. Oh, I can't watch. Can someone just tell me when this one's over? All right, Masango is like such a cool character design as well. I think I'll go back to like Scorpio Skelly again. All right, you're gonna throw something. I know it. Oh, I, I, no, 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 I got that right. So it seems like if the enemy player hits the tower, that's when I get the mask. It's red right now. Hmm. See, now it's blue. Can you hit it? Or do I have to hit it? It moves really quick in those moments, so it's actually hard to tell. But let me just try pulling it out right now and then punching it. Oh wow, it changed color. Well, I mean, it normally does that, so I guess it's not too surprising. I'm totally an arms pro. I've beaten everybody who's ever played. Oh, so try that. No, no, no. Okay, well, I got him. I wasn't even trying to. I was trying to, you know, experiment a bit. All right, that was crazy. Okay. So I had to OBS minimize itself for no reason. Maybe I could, I wanna try more gusher. We'll try a Gusher Scully. Because I feel like it, it's bouncing. Well, okay, well, he's got a grab in there. Well, that didn't goop him, but that's okay. So maybe I just have to, like, if I let him get out there. No, see, doing that made him move. Maybe I just gotta walk through it. Maybe I'm just making this more, yeah, I'm making this way more complicated than it has to be. <laughs> okay, well, there's that. Okay, so I'm yellow right now. I'm all sunny, happy little sunshine. I'm not really entirely sure what it does, but it sure can't hurt, right? Can't be like one that just like makes you do extra damage or take extra damage, I don't know. That'd be bad. I don't think that's gonna happen. So I might even not have to use my super against you. Jeez, Master Mummy is just too easy for me right now. Sorry, Master Mummy, sir. Okay. Masango's so cool though. Like gives me like the, sort of like a Tarzan vibe. Like with his body type, it reminds me of Disney's Tarzan. Like his face definitely looks different and his hair is a bit different, but like his body type's similar, which is cool. Match three, we're going into basketball, but can he dunk? He can turn into otherworldly beings. He's got some cool hair, but none of that matters if you can't dunk. Let's mix it up and play some hoops. We gotta, we gotta do it. Okay, I think we're gonna do the double Scully. I think that'd be great for grabbing. Got it, okay. Will that dunk her? Yep, it will. I mean, she is sort of kind of basketball shaped, or at least her mech is. She isn't, that would be very rude to say. Oh, uh. oh I bounced you a little bit off the thing. I don't know, it's weird. Already at seven points, so scored a three pointer there. There's two more. Can I get a perfect here? That'd be great. She's just not doing anything. She's freezing up. Oh, <laughs> sorry. Oh, it's okay, it's okay, better luck next time. That was fun. He's a really good character so far. I don't know what he was trying to say, but hey, that's fine. I like his face paint, I like the uh, little stubble. Like, I don't know if that's supposed to be stubble or if that's supposed to be face paint, but I'm pretty sure it's face paint. Yeah, I did nothing. We're not an incredibly high level of difficulty, we're level three out of 10 but I haven't played the game in months, so I figured I'd like start at level two last episode and working my way up, so they're gonna be bad at times. And Misango versus the something something, her spin kicks are famous for knocking the wind out of her enemies, but she, has she ever tried using them on an eth ethereal entity like Misango? Well, there is a first time for everything, folks. Keep your eyes glued to that screen. Awesome. <laughs> I, I scared the AI because I'm such a pro. All right, so this one might be a little weird for this because we'd have to go downhill a little bit to run into that. I feel like, Maybe our aim goes out farther. I don't know, he has some really long reach, I feel at the least. We reach like basically across the entire bowl there. All right, well she has that spin kick she's gonna use a lot. These do 70 damage, which is nothing to scoff at. Got it, got it. No heals for you, only heals for me. 
Ah! I want to try the blue one. We haven't tried the blue one. We've only tried... Hold on, hold on. Let me get through that. Oh no, this is yellow. I thought that was green for a moment. My eyes were messing with me. Get it? All right. Dodge and weave, dodge and weave. Oh. That's yellow again. I really don't know what these do, but... <laughs> that's okay. Oh man, oh man. Oh, well, yep. They're definitely not hurting. There we go. Awesome stuff. And I got the perfect. Thank you so much for another 100 fits, Link. I really appreciate it. Okay, that was awesome. Let's do the Scorpio and Skelly down. I wanna mix it up. Just hold the dash button. Uh, Oh, look at that, okay. <laughs> I learn a little more every day. Oh, no, I did that one a little bit wrong. All right, there we go, there we go. Whoa, we're tearing you up now. Tearing you up now. Yeah, I'm not really sure what's happening. I'm just trying to take a look at it. Well, yeah, she has like a haziness over her. So yeah, I guess if you have a second, you could try that. Oh my, oh my, oh my. All right, I'm glad I blocked that in time. <laughs> Let me just, while she's sitting there. Okay, I think I actually got rid of it. Okay, might have to calm down a little bit. That does something. Okay, <laughs> still figuring it out. Look at those tasty diamonds. By default, it should be holding Y, I believe. Yeah, I don't think I have any of the controls changed. You don't have to do the pillar to walk into it, though. Okay. So if you just hold the dash button, it seems like there's like something more happening after that. Is that like an effect? Or is that just something where I'm being silly? Either way, that was, that was not bad. We were able to handle it while still experimenting. So level three is actually working out really well. There should be a Twitch cereal with bits. That would be interesting. Match five, halfway there. It's Masango versus the Silver Screen Queen Twin Town. Or in, in, oh man, I didn't give me any time to figure out what that word said. But what's an aura compared to a, a spirit that can actually do something? This is going to be a battle. Why can't I just choose to read the text? I mean, I have the, you know, comprehension to know when I'm done reading it. Nice, good start, good start. Oh, now I see. It definitely is easier to hop on if like that. It's an effect he has slight lag when equipping the mask for balance. Okay, yeah, I see what you mean. Oh, let's try the blue. No, I dodged the wrong way, hold on. Ah, oh, darn. <laughs> Au revoir. Oh, I tried to get you right off the, the bat there, but that didn't really work out. Twin tail can be really tough. And now I'm, now I'm learning that in full effect. I really wanna see what the blue costume's like. At this point, I just like seeing them in different costumes. Okay, Twintel, I might have to get serious with you now. Everything from here on out's just been a warm up, but not anymore. Okay, I got it, ow, ow. Hmm. All right, throw your punches, see what happens. You know what, Never mind. <laughs> I'm still gonna get you though. Okay, that was some decent damage. This, this doesn't seem to do too much. Oh wow, yeah, she's got that haziness. Oh man, oh man, we got her though, we got her. I just need to hit her once. I just need to, yeah, okay, that was not bad. That was crazy. Coffee is good, I mean, I prefer my tea, but coffee can be good. It always like goes red, yellow, blue, red, okay. I thought I saw a green, but it must have just been the transition color. All right. Well, I haven't seen the blue yet, so I'd like to try that out. It's just not very lucky with it. Come on, catch you. You think Rush does more damage with the costumes? Uh, maybe? Hard to tell. It'd be interesting if each costume like does something different. Oh my, oh my. Like, it would be cool if like the yellow one actually affects Rush, you know, it matches up with the color. Oh wow, oh wow, ow wow, ow, ow, ow. She's very good with timing her supers. I'll tell you that much. All right, so if I could just get you into a better position. I'm waiting for her to do it, and she knows, she knows. All right. Whoa, I didn't want you to do it that way. Okay, I'm blue. And if I was green, I might die. <laughs> All right, we got it, we got it, nice. 200 damage. Oh wow, yeah, definitely, you can see it's like ticking away. That's really cool. 
Come on, we got her. We got her. We got her. She's done. Nice. Okay. That was she put up a good fight there. I'm all about fashion. Yes, I am. <laughs> oh my. That was cool. Oh, look at this. He's got a little dance. I think he already had that dance, but it looks different because of the costume. All right. <laughs> I'm blue double deep to die. Yep. That's it. Okay, let's go to the next one. What was that? Match four? I think it was match four. Yep, no, no, it was match five. Okay, match six, volleyball. Going against Lola Pop. That actually might be difficult. You know, she can, you know, become the ball volleyball, you know? To be good at volleyball, you must be one with the ball. And seeing how she can basically become a ball, I don't think it's gonna turn out too well for us. All right, let's start, let's get a good luck wiggle. Good luck wiggle. Let's try this out. I need to try out this snake arm a little bit more. Cause it's sort of like, it, it, it bounces like a little snake. Like I get the idea. Oh, oh, okay, not bad. Oh, very bad. Whoa. Come on, come on. I'm not letting this happen to me. Thank you, Lola Pop. So let me try if I can. Oh, come on, come on. I can't hit it from here. No, no, no. Oh. Spike it, spike it. Okay. Oh no, oh no, oh no. There we go, there we go, that's fine. You explained in a really long post. I must have missed it, I'm sorry. Try to keep up with all the messages, but I'll try to read that back when I have the chance. Oh my, oh my. Oh, oh. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, oh. There we go. Even if it times out, I should still win. There we go, right at the end I get the five points, that's awesome. Scullies might be fast, but the light arms, anything knocks them down. Even other light arms, since they, the light arms have plus, or two plus projectiles. Interesting, okay. And I'm trying to look for your really long post. Uh. Hmm. I don't know if like it just didn't go through. Like if it was super duper long, it might have like, you know, like I think Twitch has like some kind of like auto mod thing with that. Like if it was like a whole paragraph and a half. That was the longest message I've seen you post, but uh, Super Mario Odyssey volleyball flashbacks. Yeah, it might be that because I know Twitch sometimes has like weird auto mods with that. Where it turns him into a heavy, so only certain charges hits knock him down. He also gets bigger arms, which moves slower. Okay. But I guess it would be better to be heavy against certain characters than it would be others. All right. You're gonna take me a second, aren't you? Oh no, oh yeah, she's so quick. I definitely don't wanna be red then for her. Maybe I do, <laughs> I just totally not understand. All right, all right, got it. I love her theme song. Oh, oh, oh. I'm not good at singing though, so I probably shouldn't sing along. But it's so infectious. Oh my, oh gosh, we hit the, the invisible block of doom, gotcha! You couldn't see me, but I could see you. Oh. Now right, let's hit it with the snake, then go for the grab or not. She moves so quick in the air. I mean, that's sort of the big thing I had a problem with her with. Yellow makes him build Rush faster. Oh, okay, so it was with Rush. He's immune to damage, that's actually really cool. All right, so I definitely want a good Rush against Ribbon Girl. Any way to damage her down quickly because she can just turn around a game real fast. Ooh. But thank you for the information, I really appreciate it. Okay, so you're poisoned. I think maybe it's my uh, Scully arm that's poisoning her. Who makes him super fasting and super jump by holding dash and then jumping and super dash by holding jump and then dashing. Oh, I'm totally gonna get that mixed up. But his arms are much smaller. Okay. Okay, I definitely see what you mean. That is awesome. He's a, I honestly, or at least in my opinion, he's like the most dynamic character. Yeah, I keep on trying to grab them out of their rush and that'll never work. I mean, maybe it worked, but. As far as I know. Okay, now, 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 now. Oh, I thought she had an arm out. Oh, well, I was wrong. <laughs> but I'm still gonna get her. Boom. But yeah, he's a, he has a lot of stuff going on with him. Usually other characters, they have like one thing, but that thing is very uh, defined, and that makes it so that, you know, you can learn a lot of different things just through that one thing. But here, I like how this guy has multiple different things that have like a variety of effects. Like, that's really cool. 
Okay. Oh, up. Oh, no, no. Hold on. Out. <laughs> I've already won one round, though. So as long as I can out, not play awful. Oh, that hurt. That hurt. Okay, I got the blue. It's going to be harder to land stuff, but that's okay because I'm moving. So she has her super, and I really don't want to mess this up, but I just messed it up, didn't I? Ah, oh, she got me. Ah, oh, I gotta stop moving as, I guess, recklessly as I am. Okay, maybe I should try something else. Oh, I really like the Scullies, though, so now they're my safe zone. But we're even. Oh, man. Maybe a silly idea to move mid-match, but I mean, even if we fail here, we just gotta retry it. Okay, now I have my super, how's that sound, lady? All right, got this. Gonna punch you like that, or grab you, whatever works. You're gonna hold out your shield the whole time. Oh, I should've jumped for that one, but there we go, there we go. Oh, but I, oh man, I shouldn't have shielded for so long now because I got rid of my, uh, ah, okay. So I guess that's sort of a thing is that if you already have the shield out, you don't wanna shield again because it'll get rid of the mask and that makes it so it's harder to, you know, stay protective. All right, well, I think we're gonna get her. Can I goop her? Can I get the goop? No, I can't. Just hit her with anything at this point. I'm panicking. <laughs> He's definitely technical. Yeah, definitely the new characters seem to have a lot to them. Don't grab too much is tempting, but it leaves you without mobility. Yeah, I definitely see that. There's some things that are starting to flash back to me after not playing the game forever. You don't wanna double punch that much, poke with one arm, since it saves one arm for defense and keeps you a bit more mobile. Okay. That's why I sort of like the idea of having at least one of the Scullies, because that thing seems to move pretty quick. I mean, he feels like he has a longer reach than at least Lola. I mean, that's what my sort of my uh, comparison right now. Thread the needle, it's Misango versus the Man of Mystery Helix. There's something ominous about this place. The glow emanating from these test tubes is unsettling. Even Misango looks like he's out of, out of his comfort zone. Well, hopefully the feeling passes, cause we got a fight to get to. Awesome. Okay. I mean, we could try something different. Let's try a Gusher and the Skelly. That's a good start. Oh, oh, oh. Hold on, hold on. Oh no. Oh no. There we go. Oh no. I thought I was a little farther away from the shield. Objects may appear closer than they are, or the vice versa. All right, so I definitely want to try to hit that electricity towards him. That would be good. Uh, Punch it. Oh boy. No, 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 come on, come on. All right, at least I'm landing stuff on him. Oh jeez, oh jeez. I definitely think bigger arms are a bit of a help for this guy because he's just, he's so thin. He's got that amazing waistline. Oh, no, okay, back it up, I'm out of here, see it! Oh, I got you! Nice, I was so lucky. You don't have to shield to equip the mask, okay. Yeah, I keep forgetting that. You're definitely right. All right, so the Glusher and the Skelly seems like a good idea. Okay, now I get it. So let me wait for him. I'm so used to pulling up the shield now, though. Oh, okay, I got the Glusher on there. That's all I wanted. Nice. I seem to be able to maneuver around this guy pretty easy. Whoa, ow, ow, ow. That hurt. Okay, his super's over. This is some good fighting game practice because I don't play too many fighting games. Whoa, whoa. Especially for Fighter Z coming up. Like, I know that's gonna be like a hardcore fighting game. It's definitely gonna be hard for me to break this habit of shielding to get this out, but for now it doesn't matter too much. Whoa. Oh no, oh no, punch him! I just gotta do that, yep, one more time, we're good! Okay, see it, see you, dude! Forget your name, Helix, that's your name. That was pretty good. You're doing quite well, thank you. <laughs> All right, we got a badge for that, awesome. We didn't get a perfect, 
that round now. Okay. Look, we're close at times. Next. Semi-final. Okay, so we got this, and then we got another thing. So I don't think we go against uh, the guy with like a billion arms until when? Uh, I think level five is Masango versus the student stealth Ninjara. Ninjara is known for implementing aspects of ninjutsu passed down from ancient times. But well, Masango's got traditions of his own. History is going to be made today, folks. Let's watch. Okay, cool. Um, oh, but he's going to be so quick. I think I need to try out the Scorpio a bit more. I don't really know too much about how to use it. Oh, wow. Oh, it's goopy. <laughs> Seems like a lot of poison stuff. Poison, goop. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Ow. All right, where are you going? He's just so quick. I forgot how quick Ninja Ninjara is. I mean, he was, I think, out of the original 10 characters. He's still my favorite. Oh, uh, sort of. Oh, you did get electrocuted. I was gonna say, I sort of was hoping you were gonna get electrocuted, and you did. Okay, that was good. That was good. I like that. Oh, oh, nice jump. Ow. Oh. All right, so I'm in the lead for right now. Are you just gonna shield forever? <laughs> okay, he is. <laughs> okay, I thought he was gonna bait something out of me there. Right, I gotta peck with this because it's gonna help oh no that was quick of him probably should have been able to do that better all right got it gotta hit him one more time and I'm good that'll be helpful then right yes it will okay I'm starting to get this guy a little bit more headlock is level four okay well next time then okay uh I don't know that wasn't too bad springtron but the fight springtron you can't lose a single round all right, well, I wouldn't have unlocked Springtron this time. I didn't know, like, yeah, I knew there was something weird with Springtron where he's, like, in the game, too. Like, they added him, which is cool. I didn't know if you had to, like, unlock the character. Because it seems like there isn't a single character you have to unlock in this game. Maybe I'm wrong about that, but I'm pretty sure that all the characters are just open right away. Maybe not Max Brass, but I can't remember because I already had played every other character by the time I played Max Brass. Oh! I was ho sort of hoping that was going to get you, buddy. All right, well, I'm waiting for him to do his thing, to attack me. Oh, like that, like that, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha! Okay, still trying to figure out how I think about this snake move. Oh, you're poisoned a bit now. Oh, that was a mistake of mine. Definitely. Trying to get that poison out. Oh, okay, sir. Sir, calm it down. Oh, no, oh, no. Oh, okay, I got the shield up there. There we go. Might be good to stick with the red arms for now. Oh, okay. That was probably a mistake, but it's gonna give me the win, so what do I care? <laughs> awesome. They're all playable from the start. Okay, gun. But in GP, you can only fight him by never losing a round. Okay, well, I don't know if that's gonna happen anytime soon. Uh, but there we go, there's that. So we should be able to move on to the final with Max Brass, which will turn out one way or another. Off to Sane. I think it'll be good. We've only lost how many rounds? I think we lost two rounds. Maybe just one, but I can't remember. Listen to that crowd. The fans are fired up. It's Masango versus the Kamish Max Brass. When Max Brass first met Masango, he had a feeling that uh, the guy had what it took to. <laughs> As per usual, the Kamish was right on the money. So right the so right that Masango is about to face him himself. Here we go, folks. I'm the worst at reading. I just, I get so nervous because I know it's going to end soon that I just freeze. There we go. Huh. I always never know how to go against Max Brass. Like... Nope, nope. Oh. Because he just throws a lot of really heavy punches, so I try to stay light on my feet. Oh, here we go. Well, the blue one's going to help with that. Don't let him get a super before me. Oh, he's totally going to get a super before me. All right. At least it gets some damage on him. If I lose the first round, that'll be fine. Because at least I'll be able to learn a couple things. There we go. Gotta remember. Gotta be a bit more defensive and also just be better at the game. Have quicker reactions. Move it, move it. Block. Oh. That is just sort of a reaction I have to sort of fight or I guess beat out of me. Is that I always want to jump. When somebody goes into super, my first reaction is try to jump and dodge it. But 
It seems like it's way better just to hold on the block, because then you just take next to no damage. Oh. Oh, yeah. Okay, yep. Can't do that. <laughs> oh, man. That was bad. I never lose. I'm such a pro. Because I'm playing all the easy difficulties. Old dash to equip the mass tune. Okay. I think we'll go back to this. Okay, that was good. Because that's usually the strategy I would have way back when. When the game first came out, is I would always just block. And I sort of hope everything worked out. But usually that's how I'd... Start just in case, you know, somebody tries to grab me. I can then just jump and then go for him. Oh jeez, oh jeez. Ah, oh, that was on me. Nope, nope, no, nope. Man, he's getting me good right now. I definitely, I'm not used to this area being so small, too. Oh, I definitely need this health, so if I can get him out of here and just keep an extra couple seconds here, that'd be good. Peck at him a little bit. No! Oh, man. Oh, no, no, no. Oh. Oh, man, I almost got him, but not quite enough. He has a super, so I gotta be super careful. But if I could just get one pack on him, one good pack. Oh, oh no, oh no, I'm okay, I'm okay, don't worry. Oh, oh no, no, no. Oh, oh, it's gonna be close. Oh, it's gonna be close. Yeah, just barely, yeesh. <laughs> that was a little too much now, wasn't it? All right, it's down the line. Who's gonna win? Probably not me. All right, so I have my super. I need to be able to get the yellow one if I can. All right, all right, all right, no, no, no. Oh, no, <laughs> I'm so nervous now. Definitely try to hit that towards him. That's gonna help, that's gonna help. That didn't land. <laughs> all right, throw that punch, dude. All right, well, I did that a little too soon. Jeez, he actually had a good chance to block there and he messed it up. I know that feel. Okay. Oh no! Oh. Gotta keep to the ground. This one's gonna be close then. Cause he's in the lead right now. Hmm. Sorry if I'm a little quiet for this part. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, okay, that's good, that's good. I just need to hold on, try to get up the super a little bit. That was good. All right, throw something, throw something. Oh, okay, good dodge, but not good enough. Oh, oh geez, this is close. This is like so close, so super duper close. Oh, oh that might be it. Oh, oh, man, I am so awful at this game. That was crazy. <laughs> Also, the LMS helps you get super faster, and as well as, as well as so, it's good. Okay. Yeah, that's what I was trying to, but I was having a hard time timing it, and then you would just keep hitting me. So, hard to balance for sure. There's definitely sort of like a second nature you need to build up with this character. Look alive, people, the award ceremony is about to begin. Let's take a look around the final results. So yeah, we only perfected once, and we lost twice, three times. Yeah, okay. Okay, that's very good. I mean, comparatively to what it could have been at the least. It wasn't too bad. The winner of the Arms Grand Prix and your new Grand Champion! The spirited fighter, Masango. He's so fierce, the power of the Masango is on his side today. Congratulations! Okay, cool. There's another Arms Grand Prix, blah, 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 blah. We know what it says. I <laughs> just like how his little friend back there is just having a good old time. He's freaking out. It's like, yeah, we won. It was all me. It wasn't him at all. Okay, that was fun. So we have, you know, some time. We might as well go ahead and check out what badges we got. You've earned a thousand. Looks like you're raking it in. Uh, ooh, you played arms, arm, wait, well, you played arm getter for the first time. Get anything good? Not my first time playing it, but okay. All the pillars at the temple grounds were destroyed. The Masang enjoys such displays of victory or ferocity. 
You've thrown over a thousand punches, not too shabby. Cool. Okay, so there's a couple more badges. Let's go ahead and get some arms. We're up to 747, so we should definitely be able to do a longer one. All right, thank you so much for that, Link. I really appreciate it. Another 100 bits, that's crazy, dude. Medium timer. Okay. I'll focus on this for a moment. This might take me a moment, then I'll read your bit message. I appreciate it, though. Whole big bunch. Oh, yeah, I forgot. You gotta press start. It looks so weird with him to have normal arms. We used to have him having all these funky, exotic-looking ones. Oh, no, wait. Oh, that's bad. <laughs> the first one I got super good, like that. Oh, I'm gonna need that one. Get that, and then punch this, and then punch that over there. Oh, a little too soon. Hold on. Okay, well, that was half decent. Get that, good, good, good. We're actually getting some extra time here. Usually I don't get the extra time too much, but I'm also used to doing the shorter one. Boom. Okay. This is also very good practice for learning how to like maneuver the arms a bit more, because I always need that extra bit of practice. Oh my, oh my, try to hit that. Oh, I'm missing him, I'm missing him. Level up, 20 seconds left. Gonna get the back up to 22, yep. All right, try to get that, try to get that. We got three presents, as long as I can get a little bit more. Looks like I can maybe get a fourth one here, or I could be the worst ever. Okay, I got it. We got a couple seconds left too. Get number five. Oh, I'm, I'm just, there's too many. There's too many to hit. All right, throw my punch. Just try to get the present. Perfect. Okay, not bad. What was it, six arms? I can't complain about that. Toaster. Okay, we know about the toaster. I don't need to read that one. And then the Sparky, we also know about the Sparky. And we know about the tri So we're getting a lot of, like, you know, basic stuff here. The tri -bolt, tri blast blasting out of three side simultaneous shots in horizontal formation. Their wide blast radius leaves a little room for escape. Cool. And then this I'm not too familiar with. This is the Parabola, a true DIY gem made out of an umbrella, some infrared sensors, and an outdated electrode. Low cost, but highly effective. Oh wow, we're still getting more. It was all from a saga, that's cool. Guardian, these shield arms are steadily advancing stalwarts that can support a wide range of both offensive and defensive fighting styles. Cool. So we are good with that. And I think that'll wrap it up for another episode of ARMS. If you watched this point of the video, make sure you comment Masango Zebra so I know you've watched the end of the you are a Zebra-tastic viewer. And thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.